Masterpiece strategy for admin activities. Let's take a look at this because this is replying to emails, following up, and let's take a look at a few things because of course it's very much personalized to where your business is at and what the systems are around you. So here's some ideas to get the ideas flowing of what's the next best step you can take to move your score up the color scale. So one thing is to list all your admin activities and in early in this earlier in this module listed all the activities in your business so you could just take that chunk there because what we want to do is find all the admin activities that you currently do right now and then we can see what's the plan to delegate and there's two levels to this there's delegating and saying okay I'm gonna no longer do these ones and then set up the team member to do that or the software or a combination of the two the other thing is to look at it on a broader level, top level overview and say, okay, maybe there's a system level change that needs to be had. For example, maybe you're getting customer support emails. Maybe there needs to be a help desk, a FAQ built out for it. Okay, so take a look at what is, what is bringing you the lowest level on the color scale right now on your admin activities. And we don't have to start with everything getting wiped out and delegated, but let's at least start with a few that's really pulling your score down because that's going to free up a lot of energy, creativity, and momentum. So the plan to delegate, of course, is who, who's going to do it, when are they going to do it, how are they going to do it, is this a daily thing, is it a weekly thing, is it a monthly thing, and what's the system, what's the process for them to follow. And having, I like Google Docs, having that all in Google Doc for them so they can see it clearly. Uh, I record videos like this in the processes that I give team members so that they can see me, they can see the text of what to do and then they can also see the video screen recording of what to do as well. So take a look. What's your next step? What's weighing down your mind the most when it comes to your current admin activities? And what can you do to put software, a system, or people in place to take that off your mind and off your work list? That's all I got for you. I'll see you next video.